Does that mean yes, voice, or does that mean I have see a thumbs up? If someone could type in there, I can hear you. So we have yes, we have yes. Woo! <laughs> All right, I'm going to plug in my microphone, so there's going to be a part two. Can you still hear me? So this is the second check. Can you still hear me? Yes? No? Can you hear me? Yes. I see hearts. Fabulous. <laughs> Thank you for your patience. I really appreciate it. Okay. What is worth... Can you imagine? If I went the whole time and nobody could hear me, that wouldn't be very good. Okay, let's see. All right, so I see hearts. I love hearts. <laughs> Fabulous. Okay. All right, I'm going to switch you guys around so you can look at what's on the screen. All right. And I know it's low tech. It's low, kind of low quality, but this is what we have on Instagram. We'll probably be going live on YouTube as well in the future. And on YouTube, I can do pretty much everything, right? I can do screen share. I can do all this stuff. Okay, so the first question is, like always, uh, what countries do we have present today? Where are you guys right now? Right now, I'm in Indonesia. All right, what country are you guys in right now? Let's see if we can, if I can say hello in your language. Turkey! Ah, dang it. I can still only say thank you. Teşekkür uh, ederim. <laughs> well, I guess that would fit. Thank you for coming and joining today. Teşekkür ederim. Okay, Saudi Arabia, Ahalan. Iran, Tehran is Salam. Indonesia, Salamat Datang. Or just Alo. <laughs> France, uh, Bonjour. Bonjour. Is that girl in your videos, pop.sad, says that girl in your videos your daughter? Yes, she's my daughter. Okay, hello, someone I'm from Indonesia, Albania. Hmm, I don't speak any Albanian. All right, teşekkür ederim, all right. Okay, we could say hello all day long. <laughs> Hola, I think someone's from, uh, is Portuguese. I'm going to guess, Ira Soares Soares. Okay, but I live in Italy. Apa kabar, kabar baik, terima kasih, saya sangat senang, <laughs> sama kalian. Okay, all right, here we go. Let's get into our lesson. All right, so first we have on the screen, we have what's up, and we have what's up. So can you guys tell me what is the difference between what's up and what's up? It's quite similar, and they're, they're both greetings. What do you think? Let's see, English Village Community, you have any greeting from other country? I am proud of you. <laughs> All right. All right. So on the screen we have what's up and we have what's up. One ends with an exclamation mark and another one ends in a question mark. Comment allez-vous? Uh, je ne comprends pas. <laughs> I only speak a little bit of French. All right. So, anyone have an idea? Any have an idea? What's the difference between what's up and what's up? I don't see anybody answering. That's all right. No problem. Okay, Nina772, we have an answer. The first one means hello. I agree. And actually, they're both greetings. They're kind of a way... Let's see. Joy de vivre. Number one, what's going on? Two is what's up, as in direction. Ooh, that's possible. See, Analupo18, I don't really know the difference. Uh, what's up, says Coco, 1502965, that's a long number. <laughs> okay, Zara ELT says the first one, it means something go wrong, and the second it means what happens. Hmm. Well, let's see. These greetings are very versatile, means they can be used in quite a bit of different situations. If I was going to say the first one, it's more of a statement, right? It's kind of like saying, hello. So if you haven't seen a group of friends for a while, and you suddenly run up, you meet each other in the airport, like, what's up, right? It's kind of like, hello. You're not necessarily directly asking them a question. If they want to answer like it's a question, that's fine. 
the second one, the intonation in your voice is a little bit different. It's what's up? What's up? So it's definitely a question. But it's a little bit tricky. It's not a huge difference, but they're both greetings. And if you want to say what's up to say hello, or if you want to say uh, what's up to ask, you know, what's happening, what's going on, then you can do that as well. Okay. All right. So let's see here. This is what we're going to do today. Wahaha. So first thing we have is an inspirational quote. Next, we're going to explore a meme. Last time we did a live and we talked about what memes are, and I will review the definition. And then we're going to try something new. We're going to experiment today. We're going to see how it works. I'm going to invite you guys to be come live, and then I'm going to ask you guys questions. So we'll see how that works, all right? That may be the most exciting part. So first, let's get into the inspirational quote. Here we go, and here it is. All right, so I'm going to say it first off, and then I'm going to pause so you guys can practice your pronunciation and repeat after me. So here we go. Make each day your masterpiece. Okay, give me some apples. Show me some apples in the comments if you pronounced it out loud. Make each day your masterpiece. Show me some apples. And we're going to show me apples like these. Delicious. Okay. And so, like I said, show me some apples if you pronounced out loud. First, I'm going to show you the guy who said this, this quote. His name is John Wooden, and he is a very, very famous basketball coach from America. And he lived, I don't know if he's still alive or not, I'm not sure, I don't really follow him too much, but I like his quotes. He's a very successful basketball coach, alright? So, let's see, can anyone tell me what is the meaning of masterpiece? How about this? We'll pronounce it first and make sure we're saying it correctly. Because there's actually two parts, right? There's master and there's piece. But together, we have masterpiece. So I'll say it one more time and you guys repeat out loud. Masterpiece. And can you guys tell me what is a masterpiece? Or an example of a masterpiece? What do you think? What is the meaning of this word? I'm pretty sure you guys know the answer. We have 27 people here. Between all of us, I'm sure we can figure out what the word masterpiece means. I'm going to take a drink of water. Excuse me. All right, let's see. Serkan Karanfi says he is idle. I'm not sure what that means. Okay, Zara ELT says the best thing you do in your career. Hmm, all right. Joy de Vivre says masterpiece, your best effort. Vital, uh, Vital PT says great work. All right. Uh, Binud, Binud Hami says good job. I think those are all fabulous answers, right? So let me give you a few different ways to say masterpiece using uh, different words in English. All right, let's put them here. You could say, let's, let's see, I'll show you them all and we'll go one by one. Okay, so the first one is masterpiece can mean your greatest work, like your greatest creation. All right, Um Zain says something very precious or good work. I agree. All right, Austin Son Juan says an important task that you fulfilled. All right, so repeat after me and improve your pronunciation. Your greatest work. And accomplishment is a long word. It's something that you have completed or that you have achieved. Maybe you had a goal 
or you wanted to do something and you worked hard and you did it. So you accomplished it. So you completed it and you were able to do it. So repeat after me. Your greatest accomplishment. And the last one is usually, depending on the context, this is the one that I usually think about first. So repeat after me. An incredible work of art. And if we're talking about an incredible work of art, I'm going to show you a picture and let's see who can be the first one to tell me the name of the painting. I'm going to show you, uh, it's a painting. So you guys tell me, what is the name of this famous painting? Oh, before I show, oh, no way. Whoa. Let's see, Analupo18 just said, Masterpiece is the best thing you can do. Like Mona Lisa is Leonardo da Vinci's masterpiece. And... <laughs> Wow, that was a perfect answer before I even asked the question. I was going to ask you guys to tell me what's the name of this painting, but Ana Lupo 18 got it right away. Way to go. All right, yes, Mona Lisa, right? Leonardo da Vinci. So people would say this is a uh, masterpiece, right? And does anyone know how much it's worth? I have no idea. <laughs> millions of dollars, millions and millions and millions of dollars, right? So it's his masterpiece, they would say. It's one of his, you could say it's one of Leonardo da Vinci's greatest works, one of his greatest accomplishments. It's an incredible work of art. <laughs> it is, right? Okay, let's see. All right. So, oh, I see requests to be in the video already. Oh, we're just about finished with the, uh, with this uh, quotation. All right. So, can someone tell me, oops, in English words, another way to say this quote? So, if someone didn't speak English very well, and they want you to translate it using other words in English. In what other way could you say the same or similar meaning using this quote, but with different words? What do you think? All right, Last Supper Table. Yes, that is a very famous painting too. All right, so can you guys tell me using English, but different English words, how, what is a different way to say this quote? Any thoughts? Let's see. Da, 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 da. Let's see. Anybody have an idea? What is another way to say this quote, but in English? Hmm. Oh, if nobody answers, I'm going to have to answer. Well, the first part. Ooh, we have answers. They're coming in. All right, Turkano Zana, make your way as best as you can. Zara ELT, every day try to do the best. Jose Acuna 409, make each day your best. Nita Afshin, to be hero in your life. All right. And, oh, all right. Austin, Austin Sunwans, try your best as much as you can. Aliyari Asan, showpiece. Ooh, that's a nice word. Masterpiece, showpiece. Something that you're very proud of and you've worked very hard to achieve. All right. Okay. So, another way you could say it, let's see in English, just like you guys have been saying. Um, I'm trying to use completely different English words. Uh, try to... Let's see, how about this? Hmm, make is just a nice word, isn't it? You, so we'll say, make every moment the greatest you can. How about that? Make every moment the greatest you can. So it could be a day, or it could be a moment. But the whole idea is to kick butt, right? <laughs> what do you... 
Carpe diem, right? Seize the day, right? All right. Turkana Hosanna, live this day as if it would be the last one. Ah, I read a quote the other day. Live today as if it was your last day, but learn and study as if you would live forever. Hmm. Okay. All right. That is the quote for today, and I think we're going to... Let's see the picture one more time, because it's a nice picture. All right, so we have the Mona Lisa by Leonardo da Vinci. Seize the moment, yes. Make each day your masterpiece. So let's repeat after me. We'll say it one more time. Make each day your masterpiece. Okay. All right. Let me see, is my daughter still there? Da -da -da. Give me just one moment, I'll be right back. Okay, I'm going to go check with my daughter because I wanted to bring her on so I can show you how we're going to do the lives when I ask you guys to come on too, okay? Oh, oh you know what? We were going to do a meme today. That's right. Woo. Okay, all right, we're going to go straight to the meme, okay? So that was the quote for today. Let's move on to the meme. <laughs> Let's quick, we'll review what is the definition of a meme, and I'll show you an example. So, it's for those of you who weren't here last time, it's called a meme. It's not meme, it's not mem, <laughs> it's meme, okay? And the definition of a meme is, a meme is something, such as a video, picture, or phrase, that a lot of people send to each other on the internet, right? So it's something that has gone has gone viral. Let's see, I see a question. Ali Adi Shasan, who is that cute little girl you make clips with her? That's my daughter. My wonderful daughter. <laughs> Let's see, Husni Yek Chick <laughs> says meme, yes. That's what, it sounds like M E E M meme, but it's spelled meme like that. And it rhymes with dream, seam, uh beam, stuff like that. Oh, Ulasa Koksoy, meme has a different meaning in Turkish, I believe you. Today we're going to use the English. Alright, we're going to use the English version. Okay, so once again, a meme is something such as a video, picture, or phrase that a lot of people send to each other on the internet. And the, I'll give the same example as last time. Is yes, This is a meme. <laughs> and at the top it says, what the heck is a meme? Or in other words, what is a meme? What in the world is a meme, right? And below it says, and why am I one of them? So the joke is that it's an older lady and she's using a computer, she's using a laptop or a notebook computer, and old people don't always know how to use the internet, right? So whatever happens, maybe she has her glasses on and she's like looking at them, she doesn't make much sense, I don't understand this. So, a meme is something that's usually funny. Um, sometimes people can be offended, but uh, the main thing about a meme is that people share it really quickly on the internet. Okay, so that was the meme. All right, so let's see an example. <laughs> an example of a meme. I'm laughing because I just saw it and I'm going to show it to you guys. Here we go. Ba-boom. Alright, let me see if I can make it as big as possible. So you can see it. And this meme is very short, right? Very, very short. See, Gersektan Yana says meaning. And if you mean what's the meaning of a meme, this is an example of a meme. And you'll see a picture, usually like a strange or funny picture, with some words on it, right? This one says, loading afro 50%. <laughs> so, why don't you guys repeat out loud after me and we'll work on the pronunciation. Loading afro 50%.
Okay, so there's a few things that we should look up here. Uh, let's see, loading. I think you guys know what loading means, but let's say you're uh, you're downloading a program on from the internet and it's loading. It's starting to load. Most of the computers are quick nowadays, but sometimes it takes a long time. And the red part down low, it's getting ready, it's loading, it's loading, it's loading, right? Once it gets all the way to this side, then it's 100%, uh, right? So the second part we need to know, and let's go look at the internet. Let's see. I'm going to type in Afro. Do you guys know what an Afro is? Let's see. We'll go Afro hairstyle. All right. So this is an Afro. It's the kind of hair that usually black people have or... Well, they can, if they want to grow it out, they can, uh, from Africa or wherever. And so this is the kind of hairstyle. This is called an Afro, right? So it's just Afro. And it's short for like Afro-American, something like that. Or uh, actually, I'm not quite sure what it's short for. But either way, so let's go back to the picture. Uh, here it is. All right. So in the guy in the picture we see a guy he's sitting he's got glasses on he's looking ahead and his hair is an afro but <laughs> but it's it's not completely covering his head right <laughs> so someone wanted to make a joke of it like it's <laughs> it's loading right it's loaded half of it and it hasn't quite got to the front yet so the meme is Loading Afro, 50%. <laughs> Let's see. Gersig 10, Yana, see, it will be completed at 100. Right, right, exactly. <laughs> English with, um, with uh, Amiri says, new style, yes. <laughs> I don't have any hair, so if I only cut half off, nobody would really notice. But Let's see. Husin Yesik says, how can it be possible half bald? Well, there's probably a couple possibilities. Maybe he doesn't have a lot of hair in the front part. And if maybe it's short and he just decides to shave it all off. He just cuts it and shaves it and makes it bald. And lets the back grow out. <laughs> I don't know. But it's a very interesting picture, right? If I saw someone on the train that had a hairdo like this, a hairstyle, I would probably look and say, Ooh, that's kind of interesting. All right. English with Amiri says, you are updating. <laughs> so you could say his hairdo, his hairstyle is updating. All right. Okay. Let's see, Umzain 2724, it is impossible to be completed. I would agree. If you see the front part of his head, it's very shiny. So it's possible that maybe no hair grows there, or very little hair, or maybe he just... <laughs> I have no idea, <laughs> but that's the hairstyle he has. Okay, does anybody have any questions about this meme? Or if you're ready, let's see, Nirjash Sahu7891 says, Are you bald or have you got your hair cut? My hair is really short. I like to wear it very short because it's very easy. So. I use the I cut my own hair. I use the clippers. And I'll just show you very quick hair clippers. All right. So I use this. And then I cut my own hair all by myself. And it's just easy and I can do it whenever I need it. <laughs> English with Amir, no need to shampoo and other stuff. Well, the <laughs> Serkan Karan feel 94, it might be Photoshop. Oh, that meme could be Photoshop, that's possible. Right. I bet they used Photoshop when they put the words on top, right? Okay, so Sherry Sean says, I wonder why you are so blurry. That's a great question, uh, because if I flip it around, Let's see. I'm I'm clear. <laughs> However, the only way that I have been able to figure out <laughs> Nina 772 says I'm 
<laughs> yes. Maybe we should go down to 1%. Okay. So, uh, Sherry, Sean, to answer your question, the only way I can show you guys pictures and stuff, I haven't figured out how to do it another way on uh, Instagram Live, so I'm using my computer to show you guys the images. And it's not super clear, but I think it's clear enough that we can talk about the pictures. Okay. All right. English, I'm really says, and you're never late. Like any good teacher, you're on time. <laughs> okay. All right. I don't see any questions about this meme. I think it's almost time. I think we can move forward. What do you think? Give me, if you're ready to move forward and get to the last part, give me some apples. So show me some apples or some hearts. Those heart things are kind of cool. <laughs> and that means that you're ready to move forward to the third part of our lesson. And once again, the third part is, so let's see, we did inspirational quote, we did explore a meme, and now we're, ooh, this might be the interesting part. Invite viewers live. And forgive me if this doesn't work out perfect, <laughs> because I'm still experimenting, okay? All right, so let's see. Whoop. We did that already. Let's see. Let me find where I'm at. Okay. So. Oh, I see apples. Woo! Tasty apples. Okay. Give me just one moment and I'm going to get my daughter quick so she can come live with me and I'm going to show you guys how it's going to work. Okay? Just give me one moment. I'll be right back. Okay. All right. Sorry about that. I see Nira Sahu 7891. I like your attitude, sir, in all your phrases videos. Okay, let's see. I'm going to bring my daughter on. We'll see what happens. Okay. Okay, let's see. Let me flip my camera back around. Hello, Chloe. Hello. <laughs> all right. So can everyone... See and hear Chloe. Let's give her some apples. All right. Let's see. Oop. I can give apples too, I guess. All right. These apples are for my daughter, Chloe. All right. Husni <laughs> Yesik says, cute. Ah, thank you very much. Oh, wait. I think you meant Chloe. Ah, I thought my haircut was just so cute. Okay. <laughs> I have to unplug my uh, microphone so that I can hear Chloe talking. All right, Chloe, can you say something just to make sure I can hear you? Hello. That's wonderful. That's... Oh, let's see. Chloe, let's show them. Hola, como estas? Muy bien, ¿y tú? Muy bien. ¿Te gusta tener un video live con estas personas? Sí, me gusta. Es muy divertido. <laughs> sí, es muy divertido. Okay. Let's try uh, Nisi Juan Instagram Live. Oh, yes, Juan. Niao Nisi Juan Yu Yong Ma. Oh, Juan Yu Yong. Okay. So, my daughter speaks Spanish and she also speaks Chinese, Mandarin Chinese, and some Indonesian. But her, her Chinese is much, much better than mine. <laughs> and I'm proud of her. Okay. Oh, wait. Chloe, I'm not supposed to give a compliment when you're here. I'm supposed to be rough and tough. Okay. All right. So, Chloe, let, we're going to show them what it's like when I invite them to come live. Okay? Okay. All right. Let me just get it ready. I'm going to flip my camera around, and hopefully you can see the picture. Okay. Hopefully. Come on. <laughs> okay. All right. It's a little bit blurry, I know. And it's a little big. Oh, yeah. Now I can see it. Okay. Ugh, I'm adjusting it. And I'm going to grunt as I do it. Okay. Ugh. There it is. Okay, Chloe. This is what we're going to do. And this is the same. So everybody that's listening... This is just an example right now. 
later I'll see if you guys want to talk as well. Okay, Chloe, so what we're going to do is I'm going to bring people on. We'll be live, and we're not going to have a super-duper long conversation because there's a lot of people, right? So I'm going to say, hello, what's your name and where are you from? Mm, okay. So go ahead, pretend you we don't know each other. My name is Chloe, and I am from America. Okay. Well, I'm going to show you a picture. And I want you to describe what you see, okay? Okay. All right, here goes. And it's the best picture ever. Apples. <laughs> apples, okay. Can you tell me something about these apples? They look juicy. They look juicy. And if you could only eat one apple, which one would you eat? The red one. And why would you pick the red one? Because I usually like to eat red apples, and I think they're a little bit sweeter than the green apples. Oh, I think that is a good answer. But it's incorrect. No, <laughs> just kidding. Your choice, whatever. Okay, so that's what we're going to do. And everybody who is listening right now, um, that's going to be the format. So you guys can request to come live. I'm going to end it with Chloe right now. I'm going to kick you out. <laughs> Thank you, Chloe. I appreciate it, okay? Okay. All right. Okay. So, wow, I'm back. I'm clear. Okay, so now this is your moment to shine. So if you want to come live right now, then uh, give me a request. And I will add you, and then we'll do what we just did with Chloe. I'm going to show you a picture. Well, first I'll ask you, where are you from? And, uh, okay, I see, I'm gonna, whoever's on top, okay? Let's see, Kadri Husaifa. Here you come. Da -da 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 the first one says, waiting for Kadri Husaifa. Okay, let's see what happens. So we'll chat for a few minutes. We'll chat for a few minutes. All right, hello. All right, hello. Hi. How are you? Is How it, are you? I'm fine. Is it okay if I do not show my face? I think that's just fine. I think that's just fine. <laughs> oh, thank you. Okay. My okay. name is Huzafa oh. and I'm from Kashmir, okay. India. Oh. oh, namaste. Oh, namaste. <laughs> Namaste is actually uh, the greeting they, that Hindus greet by Namaste, and I am Muslim. Oh, let me guess. Oh, let me guess. Uh, Assalamu alaikum. Uh, Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam. That's great. All right. All right. Okay. Yeah. So. Okay. So. I'm going to do the same. I'm going thing. to do the same thing. And I hear my voice. And in the I hear my thing, voice. In but the we'll work it out. We'll work it out. I'm going to show you a I'm picture. I'm going to show you a picture. And then ask you some and questions. And then ask you some questions. Okay, cool. All right. And All right. This is very and relaxed. This is very relaxed. Very informal. Very informal. All right. Okay. All right. The first picture. The first picture. I'm going to switch the screen. I'm going around. to switch the screen around. Okay. All right. All right. What do you see? This what is do you see? A man riding a horse. Okay. Okay. And, and, go and, and go C. C. All right. All right. At the beach, I guess. Okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. It's a beach. Right. A man riding a horse on a beach. Okay. Would okay. You, would you think would, he's maybe a you cowboy? Would think he's maybe a cowboy? Yeah, maybe. <laughs> it's possible. It's possible. He's, he's wearing a cowboy hat. Sure. Okay. Sure. Um, okay. Can you tell um, me? Can you tell me how deep is he how in the water? How deep is he in the water? It's shallow, I guess. Okay. And okay. can you tell and me about the horse? Can you tell me about the horse. Horse. It's black in color. Okay. And okay. It's in motion, I guess. Okay. And okay. That's it. <laughs> Yeah. I think that's very well. And, I think that's very well. Uh, tell me one more thing uh, about. Tell me one more thing about the sky. 
the sky the sky is blue and little bit cloudy okay okay and so i have yeah, so some questions i have you some questions i'll give you okay. opportunity i'll give you opportunity if you want to ask yeah. me one question if you want to ask me one question okay can you please explain to me uh, how to use do at the end of sentence can you repeat that one can more time can you repeat that one more time yeah can you please explain to me uh, the use of this uh, word do at the end of the sentence the use of the word to the use of the word to at the do, end do t h o u g h can you spell it again i'm sorry can you spell it again i'm sorry t h o u g h do do yeah okay um uh, okay uh um, do is like do is like what they use to make bread what they right? use to make bread right yeah and you want me to give you and you want me to give you of the word at the end of, of a sentence of the word at the end of a sentence yeah yeah okay let's okay. see Let's well, see. I could ask you a question. I could ask you a question. And let me flip my screen. And let me flip my screen. So maybe you can see it as so I'm maybe typing. Maybe you can see it as I'm typing. Um I could um, I could see what is in what is in the dough? The dough. Let's see if it flips around. There we Let's go. Let's see if it flips around. There we go. And I'll get it focused once more. I'll get it focused once more. like maybe you have not, a bakery not, maybe you have a bakery not dough not D -D. dough <laughs> not dough <laughs> t o u g h all right one sec let me all right one sec let me d o u d o u g h g h yeah listen this d o u g h d o u g h sometimes in short form we write it as t h o oh No. Oh, no. Is that yeah. right? Is that right? Oh my. Oh my. I apologize for my I apologize for my <laughs> It's okay. <laughs> All right. So though. All right. So I though. think I pronounced it incorrectly. Well, it's a, it's well, a, it's an it's opportunity. A, it's I think it. It's an opportunity. I appreciate it. So let's Yeah. Practice so let's our pronunciation. Practice our pronunciation. And everyone else can yeah. too. Everyone else can too. And Okay. I'll put the camera on my face. The camera on my face. The tricky part with this the word. The tricky part with this word is the first is part. Is the first though. part. Though. Oh. <laughs> though, right? Though, right? Though. So, labiodental. So, let's Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Labiodental words. Yes, labiodental. Yes, labiodental. <laughs> oh, <laughs> lovely. Oh, lovely. So that's you right. The so that's right. It's going to come up. It's going to come up. Oh, and touch no, the no. Touch lips, right? And it has to touch, right? And it has to touch the top teeth as well. The top teeth as well. So. Okay. So. Okay. So at the okay. end of the sentence. So at the end of the sentence. Oh, I'm going to switch back. Oh, I'm going to switch back. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's see. So it's common to say So it's common to say even though at the beginning of the sentence. Um, um how do I think oh, think it? oh here, we go. here we go I don't, I don't think, think that's, that's good, good though. though Okay, okay. That, that that's, that's an, an option, option. Mm -hmm. and, and it just, just means, means it just, just adds an extra, extra kind of, kind of emphasis. emphasis I don't, I don't think, think that's, that's good, good though Mhm mm uh in Am I answering, I answering your, your question? question? Maybe I need to check there. there. <laughs> <laughs> I think uh, though is kind of uh, using but at the end of sentence. Is using, using a what? I'm sorry. But b u t. Oh, oh good. good. It's kind, it's of, kind like of like that. that. Hmm. But it but would it sound strange, strange to say. To say I don't, I don't think, think that's, that's good. good but... <laughs> <laughs> right, right. So, it, so it, I don't I think that's, that's good. good though. Though. So, so you could, you could kind of add, add extra, extra emphasis, emphasis when you're, you're trying, trying to maybe, maybe I disagree with someone. With someone. Okay. I don't, I don't think, think that's, that's good, good though. though. Yeah. yeah. All right. Okay. Thank you so much for right. joining. <laughs> Thanks, Thanks for coming on. Thank you. And we're going to move to the next person, all right? Okay, bye-bye. Bye bye. bye, -bye.
Okay. All right, let's see. Though the weather is bad, we go picnicking in Mahir Moon. All right. Uh, please do something about the echo. I'm getting crazy. Yeah, I'm not quite sure how that works. If it's my phone or what's happening. Um, we'll see. We'll see what we can do with the next person that comes on. So go ahead and go ahead and request. And whoever pops up with a request, then I will add you in and we'll do another picture, okay? All right. Any requests? Pop said says, are you in the US? No, right now I'm in Indonesia. Okay. Are there any other requests to join? I have more pictures that we can talk about. Hopefully the echo wasn't so bad that it was hard to hear. I had to talk slower. Okay. The echo. I wonder why the echo was there. Hmm. Okay, oh, we have two others. Let's see. All right, we did a female before, so let's switch to a guy. We'll go to the top one on there. Farhad Wasan. All right. Waiting for Farhad Wasman. Okay. Waiting, let's see what happens. If there's echo, I'm going to stick in my microphone and then I'll pull it out when I need to talk. We'll see how. Hello. Hello, my friend. All right, good. There's no echo this time. I'm not sure what happened before. I don't know. We haven't any problem. What about your subject about talking? About, oh. Well, first, if you could tell me your name and where you're from. We'll start right there. Yes, of course. Let's see. Oh, it's loading. Ah, he left. <laughs> okay. Let's see. I need another request. The person disappeared. <laughs> Poof. All right. Let's see. Oh, we have the request. Okay, we'll go to the next one on the list. Husni, I'm sorry, I'm going to say your name incorrect, so I'll just add you, and you can tell me how to say your name. Waiting for Husni Yesik. Hopefully I said that correct. Let me get a drink of water. Hello. Hello. <laughs> okay, can you tell me your name and where you're from? I am Husni Husni yes, okay. I'm from Turkey. From Turkey, okay. Now, is there no, echo? this time it's not. Okay. Maybe there was something with the last call. I'm not sure. Okay, I got it. Okay. Yeah, how are you? So Teshik, <laughs> I'm well. Teshikur ererim for coming on. Sorry. <laughs> uh, Teshikur ererim. Hi. Yes. Is that right? Yeah. Thank you. Means thank you. <laughs> okay. So I'm about to show you a picture. Yeah. And. You, you tell me all about it, okay? Okay. I'm ready. All right. I'm going to switch switch the screen and let's see how it goes. All right. Let me move in a little bit. Yes. And can you I see it? The kids. Um, okay. Um, where are they? <laughs> the kids in the forest or in the garden. Okay. And all right. the boy is trying to take... A photo of her. Okay. Yes, that's it. Okay. Very well done. <laughs> All right. So let's see. Uh, let me ask you a couple questions. I think you might have answered some, but we'll try to go for more detail. Okay. What is the, env the environment, the location? Environment. Um... E environment is just another way to say... Location, yeah, the place. Awesome. Maybe, um, I don't know how to say in English, but uh, uh -huh. the season is spring <laughs> and <laughs> <laughs> the flowers blossom. Yes, sure. If you ask me, how about you ask me, ask me the question, what is the environment? What is the environment? Okay. I would say it's cool. right. It's outside, right? We're not inside a building. Yeah. It's probably close to a forest. 
Forest. Possibly a jungle. I would probably say a forest. Yeah. And there's a boy and a girl. And wait, I won't go. That's for you. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. So the location is outside near a forest, probably in a meadow. meadow. Do you know what a meadow is? No. A meadow is like an open area with flowers and long grass.、Mm. How can you spell、okay. it? Meadow. All right, it's M E A D O W.、Hmm. But I think I can give me one sec. I'll move the picture aside, and I'll bring up this. Can you see? Yes. Okay. okay. And then the first one was environment. The big one. Uh huh. I know it. All right. Wonderful. So you could say that they're in a meadow. Mm hmm. Damn. Um. Probably、oh. toward, toward towards the edge. Of a meadow because it looks like if they walk farther, it's going into the forest.、Mm -hmm. All right. So, can you tell me about the clothing that they're wearing? Clothing.、Uh, the girl is in a dress. Is in a red dress. Okay. And the boy、yeah. has shirt, blue shirt, I think, blue or close to blue. <laughs> And、right. he has a pant. Okay. Yes. All right. I think that's very very well done.、Uh, the girl has a little cute red dress on.、Mm -hmm. The boy, you could say he has a light blue shirt and it's long sleeve, so the sleeves go all the way down. Yes. And then he has long pants, and the long pants are probably like light brown, perhaps. Mm-hmm. All right. Okay. Let's see. What do you call? Can you see my mouse? Yes. Uh huh.、Three、what do、pot. you what do you call? Say it again. Tripod. 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 Right. Ah,、oh, sorry. It's all right. Isn't this? I think you're three thinking. Tripod, like it has three、uh, legs. <laughs> right. You're right. Try at the beginning is like the you know triangle, right? Hmm. Triangle.、So、means、okay. three. I and I'm not sure. From three, like one, two, three. Right, like three legs, right? Yes. Right. Um. So, I'm not not sure how they pronounce it in the UK, but in America we usually say tripod. Tripod. Okay. Tripod. Right.、Mm -hmm. And one last question, and then you can ask me one. Okay. Okay. Why Why do you think the little boy? Is looking at us. Hmm. I think he doesn't know anything about the camera. How <laughs> does it work? I don't know how does it work. <laughs> Please help me. Like, it looks like that. <laughs> <laughs> right. Maybe he's confused. Yeah. Or he doesn't understand. Right. Okay. I'm gonna switch. Very well done. If if the other students were here, I would have them clap. I like to have them clap for everyone. <laughs> Okay, all right. So I'll switch back around. Actually, I don't need this anymore. So go ahead and ask me a question. Hmm. Um. Hmm.、Uh, I have a question. When、okay. they say good morning, like in every morning, good morning.、Uh, is there、mm -hmm. any ways to say good morning? The But in English, right? <laughs> yes. Sure, you could say good day. Good day.、Um, the Australians they like to say good day. <laughs> It's just combining good plus day and putting it together.、Uh -huh. um, well, good morning is basically a greeting, right? Yeah. So we're just talking about greetings at the beginning of the day.、Mm -hmm. So you could say good day. Yeah. Good morning.、Uh, how are you? How have you been? Uh huh. Uh, if you if you saw at the beginning, I had two. I had what's up question or what's up a statement. Um, but specifically to refer to morning. Hmm. Sometimes. I mean, if you really go ahead. Uh, I heard、uh, some natives they say morning, morning like that. Sure. Is it okay? Sure. I. Yes, and that's probably something like you just said. The natives will say. When I was working in the U.S.,、uh, you get to the office, and you just say morning. Morning, just morning. <laughs> I'll, I'll just, let me show you how it's written. 
because it's actually slang and it's incorrect English. Mm -hmm. But what do we know about native speakers? <laughs> they don't speak in correct English all the time. Not yet. So correct would be good morning, but they shorten it to morning. Morning, yeah. Morning. So just repeat after me. Morning. Morning. <laughs> right. And All right. Did I answer your question? Yes, I have one last question. Uh, be quick. <laughs> uh, I heard that uh, the native natives um, are confused using there and there. Is it true? And just, I'm going to flip it back around to make sure I understand what we're talking about, okay? Yes. Let's see. There. And there. There. Yes. And there. Oops. There. And which one are we talking about? All of them. All of them? Yeah. All of them. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right, we'll do this real quick. Let's see. There is like to show possession, to show, show someone owns something. Their house. Maybe their fish. <laughs> uh, I'm asking, their camera. I'm asking if uh -huh. the, uh, the natives uh, are really confused about these three words. Oh, I think that's a great question. I think, this is my opinion, I think they're not confused about the meanings, uh -huh. but when they write them down, <laughs> yeah. some I people don't... They don't spell very well, so they know what it means, but when they write it down, it becomes confusing, and people are like, huh? Right. Oh, got it. Okay, that's it. Thank <laughs> you right. so much All right. for your help. Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Okay, let's see who else I have on the line. We'll go to the next one. Gotcha, Rush. Let's see, Chloe, we're going to have to wait for you. Okay, let's go to the next one. Oop. Someone who has already been there waiting a little bit, I think. All right. I uh, didn't quite read the name, what it is, but we'll find it. Please pronounce she, 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 she. <laughs> Rofik Gula. Oh, where did the person go? She, she, she. <laughs> All right, the request, where did he go? I'm at Bidder. We're going to try to add you, okay? Hmm, it didn't come in, so we'll go up to the another one. Try to switch back and forth between men and women, all right? All right, so someone said, she, C, and C. The last two sound the same, but they're... Hello. Hello. <laughs> How are you? Can you tell me... I'm very well, thank you. Can you tell me your name and where you're from? I am Nasik, and I am from India. India. And Namaste or Assalamu as Alaikum? Namaste is the commonly used greeting. Okay, so Namaste. Welcome. Oh, are you ready? For, yeah. Are you ready for, for your picture? Yeah, yeah. All right. I'm Let not very good at English, but I can speak it. Uh, uh, lacking some confidence, that's a problem. Well, the best way to build confidence is to do it. I get right? it. Yeah, sure. Okay. Because, All right, here comes your picture. Because oh, we, we, don't, we don't get enough chances to speak in English. Yeah. Uh, uh, that's the main problem, and uh, most of the people are very much afraid of mistakes. That's the main thing. Yes, I agree. And I'll give you a secret. Mm. If you, when you learn a language, try to learn a language as if you were a child. Yeah, because yeah. Because children do not, they're not afraid to make mistakes, and it makes them more confident. Yes. Okay. Yeah, definitely. Here's your, here's your picture. Ah, uh, yeah. All right, tell me what you see. I'll try to make it focus. Ah, uh, yeah. Oh. Okay, what do you see? Ah, uh, this Bahubali, is it? Is it? I'm sorry? A, I think it's a Bahubali film. It's taken from Bahubali film. I don't know. It's possible. Can you tell me what's in the picture? It's uh, an elephant, and, and a man is trying to 
uh, catch its tongue. <laughs> I think that's very well done. Yes. Yeah. So we have an elephant. Is the elephant standing or sitting? It's uh, sitting and trying to stand up. I think. Yes, I agree. And it looks, I think. I'm sorry if the picture's not super clear. I think it's a lady over here. Uh, and it's, it's a man, I think. Okay. Hey, um, I'm sorry. Instagram has just told me that I have 20 seconds remaining. <laughs> It's uh -huh. going to cut me out. I'm going to try to come back, though, okay? We'll see what happens. Okay. All right, so 12. All right, I apologize. I can't. <laughs> Hello, I'm back. You can't get rid of me. Hello, Wu Chao 131. All right. All right. So I went too long. I guess it's what, one hour? And then it cuts you off. <laughs> so I apologize. Maybe I should have planned better, but I can't control Instagram. But this is what we'll do. We'll do one more person, okay? Because we're already, it's, wow, it's already getting late. You guys are fun. All right. So here we go. We'll do, I apologize, oh, and I apologize to the last guy who got cut short. I'm sorry about that. All right, so let's, last time we did a man, so let's do a woman. Ana Lupo 18, let's see if that. All right, waiting for Ana Lupo 18, let's see what happens. And hey, Chloe, how about this? Before we close, Chloe, um, I'll have you come on live. Hello. No, I cannot believe it. <laughs> okay. okay, can you tell me where you're from and what is your name? I'm from I'm from Brazil, but I live in Italy. My okay. name is Anna. Welcome to Able Idioms Live. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, Thank you very much. <laughs> I guess I don't tell everybody all the you time. You surprised me. <laughs> oh. You made me a surprise. Thank you. So, you're welcome. So my name is Michael, and are you ready to see a picture? Okay, I'm ready. All right. Can I get more enthusiasm? Say yes. Yes, <laughs> please. <laughs> okay, I really here we want go. to see this picture. So I will show you the picture and just describe it to me. It's very informal. All right. Okay. Here we go. It goes. So. In. There we go. What do you see? Uh, there is a couple and uh, the guy is riding, riding a bike. Uh, she's trying to kiss him. Um, <laughs> uh, what more? Help me do some uh, question. Make okay. Me, make some questions. Let's see. I I think right now you're at a, you've done very wonderful. If I wasn't looking at the picture and I used your description, I would have a similar picture in my head, and that's the purpose. Okay. They they are outside. Um, they uh, they have a good day. Uh -huh. uh, sunny day, but uh, there is um, there are uh, some clouds. All right. Um, I think uh, they are happy. Okay. In this very moment. All right. Um, are you ready? Are you ready for some questions? Okay. Let's All right. Go. What do you think their relationship is? Uh, I think they are. Um, Together, they are uh, boyfriend and girlfriend. And if I if I asked you if they're brother and sister, what would you say? Hmm. Uh, I think it uh, would be possible, be because um, actually it's not uh, a uh, kiss that uh, would make make us um, believe. Just in a couple of uh, boyfriend and girlfriend. Okay. It's possible. How about if I asked you if it was father and daughter, what would you say? No, it's not. It wouldn't be possible, I think. And why is it Because they, they look, they, they, they look uh, the same uh, age. Ah, I agree. All right. So your description, they're outside. 
they're riding a bicycle and when they're riding a bicycle who is actually sitting on the seat uh who is actually who? sitting on the seat the guy the guy and where is the woman sitting hmm the um, gear shift you... no i don't know i don't know how <laughs> i can say it <laughs> all right so she's I'll, i'll describe it and then i'll type it so you can see it okay it's okay the, thank you it's the part where you put your hands and you hold and you steer the bicycle right yeah and in english let's see if i can move it over here Hand, they're called handlebars handlebars right handlebars so, okay and one let's see one more do you think let me it, write it down so oh. <laughs> i oh, can yeah. learn it <laughs> handlebars handlebars right great thank and you very much <laughs> let me ask for you your help. one more i'll ask you one more question and then you can ask me one question okay okay um if they were on a a street would this be a safe or unsafe way to ride uh i think i think it uh, would be an unsafe way to 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 ride um, on a street uh, you you have to be more to have you have to have more attention aha uh-huh. i think uh, she is the dis- disturbing him in this in case you have to 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 right. drive in on the street if they're on the street and suddenly there's a car and they have to stop <laughs> she yes. would uh, she would fly off <laughs> okay yes yes right, i'm going to switch the camera and now it's your turn ask me a question oh um But, It's, you don't have to what, it's up to you <laughs> oh whatever i want uh, so tell us about uh, your um, practicing uh, classes i i really would uh, would know about it how i can make uh, a course with you um practicing speaking mainly okay well you can go to ableidioms.com <laughs> okay and, i'm i'm i mean already okay and um if you want to have private lessons with me i do charge so you can go on there and there's a price um i also have courses i'm building up more courses um yeah I, i think uh, sorry sorry um i saw this uh, but uh, i saw this is uh, something if you have to 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 if you want to talk about love uh, about uh, business i i think um you you need to put more more option ah i'm growing thank you for the ideas <laughs> great great <laughs> right right okay So I guess that's it. Thank you for your time and I think you no, did wonderful. Oh, thank you. Thank you for the surprise. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh let's see ciao could be both Portuguese and ciao. Italian. Right? Yes. Uh, <laughs> great. <laughs> okay. <laughs> thank Bye, you. Ciao. Okay. So Chloe, I think we're going to finish up. Chloe, are you still there? You want to go live? All right, let's see. All right, let's see. All right, here we are, Chloe. Hi. <laughs> so, we'll start with you and we'll end with you. So what would you what would you like to say Um that there's a lot of people viewing this I guess <laughs> that's the first well, thing that comes to mind I think we should say thank you to them because 
if it's just you and I, it's fun, but it's much more fun if we have students, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, all right. I see uh, some comments. Where are you? We're in Indonesia, in different rooms. Hmm. All right. So I think that's going to be it for today. We've already yes. All right. Nina seven seven two says Chloe with a different account. Chloe, do you want to tell them about your new account? Uh, sure. I have two <laughs> accounts in total, and one is just for fun, and the other is Gatsubers. Since now I actually like it, and I get to know it a lot, and I just wanted to do it for an Instagram account, and I did it. <laughs> okay. And all right, I think that's wonderful. I might have to start following you. Hmm. And I wanted to say one thing quick. Uh, when I was talking with the lady before, and she had asked about the courses that I have, and she said there's about love and business. <laughs> and my courses are a little bit unique. I have different kinds. But what I do is I pick one idiom, and then I build off of that one idiom. So the whole course, we don't keep saying the idiom over and over and over. We use that idiom. We do the definition, pronunciation, uh, conversation, we create sentences, we create, we use that as a foundation, but then we create all this stuff using that idiom. So at the end, the purpose is for you to master the idiom and improve vocabulary and grammar and all that stuff along the way. So I hope you guys uh, have taken the free course. If not, you can go to ableidioms.com and uh, it says get a free course, I think. That's an option. It's free. It will give you weekly updates. So every, I think, Tuesday, what, Chloe, what day is today? <laughs> Wednesday. Wednesday. Right? You forgot? I don't know. So every Tuesday, we put out new lessons for that free weekly course. So you're welcome to sign up. That would be great. All right. So let's see. Let's say thank you in as many languages as we can. How about that? Can I say it? Go ahead. Okay. Tima. Terima kasih. Thank you. Kese. Gracias. That's mostly okay. all the languages I can do. In English, so you got four, right? All right. So let's. So let's see. In Arabic, I think it's. Oh boy, I think it's. Shokran. Yes, Arabic is shokran. Shokran. Uh, is English, French, merci, uh, German. Danke, danke schön. Let's see, Hindi is uh, Hindi is Danivad. Also in close to Urdu in Pakistan and India is Shukriya. So anybody from there, Shukriya. Let's see where we're going with the alphabet. Uh, J, Japanese is Arigato, Arigato, Mr. Lovato. K, uh, Korean is Kamsahamni Dad. So anybody from Korea here, come uh, to Let's see, M, Mandarin Chinese, Chloe just said it, Shei Shei. Cantonese, Ch Cantonese Chinese is Doche. And Chloe, do you remember how to say uh, Hokkien? Thank you. Um, I forgot. Uh, Gumsia, right? <laughs> no, like, oh, I, I, don't, I forgot. I forgot. Yeah, I think it's Gumsia, yeah. Gumsia. And then let's see, what else we got? Russian, spasiba. Anybody from Russia, spasiba. Thank you very much for watching. I uh, think uh, Scottish, it's tapadlet. I don't know how to say it, but I know how to, I know how to read it. I forgot. Okay. All right. Oh, and then uh, American Sign Language. Chloe, do you know how to say thank you in American Sign Language? Thank you. You just quoted. If thank you want to be more formal, but thank you. Thank you for watching us. Thank you for we had a you. lot of fun. We had a lot of <laughs> Thank fun. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Muchas gracias. Terima kasih. Oh, yeah, Indonesian. Terima kasih. All right. So I'm going to end the live. And I will also post this one with my other one so you guys can view it for 24 hours. All right. Until next time, I'll see you later. I'm kicking you out, Chloe. <laughs> Goodbye.